Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Sky. So I, don't judge me, but I've been copping some stuff from Supreme. You might've seen some shirts that I've copped, um, but I copped the, uh, the bowling ball, which I have down here. Um, and I've seen like video and pictures and people are complaining and probably canceling their orders because they think that it's super small. I haven't taken a look at it myself, but we're going to do that today and unbox this thing. So I've looked up, it says on the website, the bowling ball was eight and a half in diameter, which is actually what a normal bowling ball size is. But I think sometimes bowling balls can be thicker, but still have that diameter. I don't know. I don't know much about bowling because I've never owned or bought a bowling ball before. So we're going to see. But I got the medium sized one and I think that means the holes are medium sized. So because I have relatively small hands. So maybe the video of the dude with the bowling ball had just super large hands. I don't know. But we're going to ultimately figure out if this is going to be a decorative item or if I'm going to be able to take it out. I would be scared to take it out, but we're going to go ahead and take a look at it now. Is there could be potentially somebody out there that uh, didn't manage to cop it on the website and maybe you want to cop it on the resale, retail, resale, resale market. Okay. And also this is a 12 pound ball, by the way. But uh, the bottom of the box, the bottom of the box was kind of like this. So that's fun. But I think I got two, two Supreme stickers, just the regular red Supreme stickers. So, um, but I want to open it from the top. So this is what the box looks like. Did I say it's 12 pounds? Because it's, it's a 12 pound ball. On the top you got Supreme, and then you got Storm. Storm, because it's a Storm brand ball. Supreme on this side. And here it says color is white and red. Gross weight is 12 pounds and the size is medium. So there you go. Okay. So here it is. Tell me that this is not a regular size bowling ball. Like, tell me. This is a regular size bowling ball. Sorry, I'm, ju I'm just taking a peek at it. <sighs> like, like if I go to a bowling alley, this is literally about the size of a ball that I get. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't know if, if the dude in the video that I'm referring to didn't have a real size ball. Because tell me this isn't a regular size bowling ball. Like I'm super weak. <laughs> I don't go bowling often. So about 12 pounds is like, where I'm at or I do less than that because I am a weak boy but this tell me this isn't a regular size bowling ball because I'm pretty sure that it is I don't know this is just kind of a rant but also just want to show you guys the bowling ball I kind of do wish that it came with some sort of stand to put it on you know but it does not it just comes wrapped in this plastic bag here and then two little, little like um, styrofoam pieces in here. No stand, a stand is probably something you could buy, but you wanna make sure that it fits. Like, I think a bowling ball is, is slightly smaller than a basketball, I'm actually not sure. But you could probably use a stand for that, but you'd want to make sure that it actually can withstand 12 pounds so it doesn't like snap. So maybe not a little piece of plastic stand, if you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, in terms of the finger holes, I only have a little bit of space. And then here's my thumb. 
So I don't know what the true difference is between the medium-sized ball and the large. I'm still assuming that that is determining the whole size. I'm not sure if it change. I don't think it changes the size of the ball. Um, but yeah, I think for the most part, my fingers fit in there nicely. They don't, it doesn't feel like it's too, like I would, you know, I got a good grip in there. So, so yeah. So here is my average size small hands holding this bowling ball. So, this is pretty much what I wanted to show you guys today. So let me know if you guys managed to cop. And also, like I said, let me know if in your opinion, with me holding this ball with average size hands, do you think that this is a normal size ball? Because I feel like it could be, and it is. So, yeah. That's all I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, let me know what you guys think of this bowling ball, I guess. This wasn't really part of the... Is it WTAPS? Or is it WTAPS? You know, the incense grill stuff. I didn't want to spend $500 on that. So let me know what you thought of that collab. I don't think this was part of it. I think this was just something that dropped with it. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to check out all the links in the description and uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And let me know also if you're interested in me doing like, if I, if I do cop something from a Supreme Drop, if you're interested in me making a video on it when I do it. I actually bought um, two sets of thermals. So if you guys wanna see that when I get it, also let me know. But I got the, uh, the black and white set, you know, sold separately. You know, I didn't get the red set, which I should have, but that's a lot. Like, it's like eighty dollars or something for the for a set plus shipping if you get it in a different order. But also, it's all sold out. So, but I'm kind of sad I didn't just go ahead and cop the red too, just because red's my favorite color. But I truly needed some more thermals because it's getting cold out, and I like to wear like nylon fitted pants and stuff like just normally, and. uh yeah, it'll help me stay warm. So that's cool because it gets cold here and it snows. So I live in the Midwest, in case you didn't know. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.